Air France, a plane is missing. It was on its way from Rio de Janeiro in Brazil to Paris when they lost contact with it. CBS News correspondent Mark Phillips is in London this morning with the latest. Good morning, Mark. Good morning, Maggie. Well, as you say, this was an Air France flight, number 447, from Rio to Paris. It was due to land in Paris at about 11 o'clock, just after 11 o'clock Paris time. That's about 5 a.m. Easter after a seven or so hour flight uh, from Rio. Uh, the information at this stage is sketchy, but I'm afraid it's not very good. There were 228 people on board the plane, according to Air France, which issued a statement this morning saying it regrets to announce that it, was, it is without news from Air France flight 447 flying from Rio to Paris and shares the emotion and worry of the family's concern. The plane disappeared off radar, which of itself isn't that extraordinary as this was a trans-oceanic flight and a long bit of ocean to go over, but it also disappeared from radio contact, and that, of course, is extremely worrying. Uh, search has been mounted, according to Brazilian authorities, on an island chain about 200 miles off the Brazilian coast looking for this uh, Airbus A330, that we, one of a sister plane of which we now see. See, Air France has set up a crisis center in Paris, but everybody is very, very concerned. Maggie. CBS's Mark Phillips in London. Joining us right now from Washington with more is CBS News aviation correspondent Nancy Cordes. Good morning, Nancy. Maggie, good morning to you. Here's what we know right now. This plane left Rio de Janeiro, as you said, around 7 o'clock local time last night. And it was an Air France jet bound for Paris, an Airbus A330 with about 228 people on board. It lost tra contact with air traffic controllers over the Atlantic Ocean about three hours into the flight. Brazilian authorities mounted a search mission this morning northeast of that coastal city of Natal. But right now, French transportation officials appear to be very pessimistic. They say they don't have much hope at this point. And uh, as for the FAA, American authorities, they normally don't get involved at this point in the investigation. So they don't have that much to add right now. Though, of course, the NTSB will assist if there is a crash to be investigated. Maggie. CBS's Nancy Cordes in Washington. Nancy, thank you.